Hey guys, what's going on? Steve Rao here with the Bass Hang, and I am bringing you a bass demo. Today we are demoing the Wilkins Cayenne WRTJ5. This is the Wilkins Road Tested 5 String Jazz Bass. It is a Cayenne model, which means it is roasted. So it this one is completely roasted. It has a roasted maple fingerboard, a roasted maple neck, and a roasted alder body. Pat Wilkins calls those his Cayenne model. So again, it's the Cayenne Wilkins Road Tested J5 or Jazz 5. Uh, I am going into my Ready and going into my Apogee Duet and straight to Logic for the playing examples. So all playing examples will be that. Otherwise, I am recording with my iPhone at 4K, so pretty cool, and my voice is being recorded with the mic 96K directly to the phone. So um, let's talk about this bass. It is loaded with Aguilar single coil pickups in the 60 spacing, hip shot hardware all over the place. Uh, the other rad thing about roasting is it brings out any figuring to the wood. So this maple is just seriously flamed. It's just gorgeous. So um, yeah, that is a really nice perk to roasting or torification. Um, the other thing this has, this has an Audair Jay-Z preamp. It is a four band preamp. So in this case, I have a master volume. I have pickup panning. I have stacked bass and treble. I have low mid, high mid, and then I have this little light. So I'm gonna make some noise here. So when I plug in, you can see that blue light flashes. That means my preamp is good to go. There is no bypass, but what happens is, is if you plug in and you see this light start to go dim or it flashes three times, I believe, you have 10 hours to change it. So basically you could be at a gig, it starts running out of juice and you're still fine and good to go for that gig. Unless your gig is more than 10 hours, which I fortunately have not had that, so that's a good thing. So usually a gig is what, four or five hours, if that, not even that playing time. So um, let me run through some um, sounds, but first of all, there's the back. It is just, this is just a gorgeous, gorgeous instrument. All right, so let's go through some sounds. So flat, I have everything flat. Let's uh let's hear the bridge pickup. That's bridge pickup by itself. Neck pickup by itself. Alright, so let's go back to both pickups, straight up in the middle, and we're going to boost the bass a little bit. So this is boost the bass boosted. Here is the treble boosted. Now let's boost the low mid. I'm gonna turn it up all the way. So here's low mid turned up. Alright, high mid turned up. Let's boost the bass and the treble a bit. I kind of like that with the bass and treble boosted a bit. So here is back pickup with the bass and treble boosted a little bit. I kind of like that. Here's a little slap thing with the bass and treble boosted and the low mids cut. Now, 
low B is just thunderous. Just a wonderful, wonderful low B. All right, so here's, um, let's do the bass boosted and the high mid cut a little bit. So that's that high mid cut. Now let's cut the low mid. And then let's boost the highs. So I kind of like that low mid. Here's both pickups with the low mid. Bridge pickup. Neck pickup. It's a powerful, powerful preamp. I really like it. So let's cut a little bit. So check this out. So that is, that's both pickups. Flat. Here's the bass cut. So maybe somewhere you'd like that, but in general, I like the bass right in the middle or boosted a little bit. That's boosted and flat. And maybe the bass boosted with the high mid. That gives a really nice sound. So it really, really has a huge, huge palette of sounds. And I like the Audaire preamp a lot and I like these Aguilar single coil pickups and they are relatively relatively quiet too so here check this out so I'm turned up I have the volume up as you can see there's the bridge pickup by itself and the neck pickup by itself and I really don't hear any hum I do believe this has the anti-hum circuit in it so it's very very cool so um anyways i hope you liked it that's the wilkins cayenne wrtj5 model by pat wilkins road tested cayenne roasted model um and all the bumper you've been hearing is basically this same bass going directly through the ready with a drum track so i hope you like it wilkins road tested bases very very good stuff see ya